cross choke details. We're going to start from mount here. And one thing to do when he has his elbows down, he's really firm here. One drill that we do is we're going to take this, we're going to lean over here to this side. And as we do that, so we're picking up the elbows, moving up. And now we lean to this side, get the elbow, pick it up like this. Now he's nice and high. When we get our collar grip, we'd like to get as far back as we can into the, into the tag. And we're going to put a fist right here. Uh, part of that, you want to listen up? Part of this is you can almost consider that you're putting your hand into the mat. And what I'm doing is creating a post up against his neck. So when I do the cross choke, all the force is going to go back into this post. So this, this hand isn't going to be very loose. So now he has his head stuck to the mat right here. One way to go around this is to take this grip and we're going to take it and we're going to drive his elbow right down the middle. So right here, we're just going to take this and drive it. Put your head down. Yeah. <laughs> so that's what it does, it, it lifts it up. Of course it tightens up here, so you're going to have to, once you get here, you're going to have to loosen it a little bit to get this grip. So we're going to go in here. Now we can go along this side, get our thumb in right here, lean a little bit out and go here. And to finish this, we're bringing our elbows in. Our hands are going to come in and we're bringing our head to the mat so we bring it everything in and we start bringing head to the mat like that obviously when we're in this position we're compromised so it is common that you get rolled Good. Feel free. so if you roll just keep the grip right here and you can still finish it from here same thing bring it up like that as long as you keep your grip. Now if you, uh, if you are fighting this and you get one grip out, what we can do is similar to a, uh, a sweep that we do from full guard, where we're taking this and we're punching it out here. What it does is it exposes the side of the neck. So as it does that, I'm going to take this hand, come over, I'm just going to grip this back here. But what I want to do is chop the hand. I don't just want to grip and try to loose, uh, tighten that up. I want to go grip and now I'm going to bring him back to center and then with my with my hands I'm going to bring him down and in and then just choke right there so if I have this one grip and he's fighting with this arm tucking his chin right here I can take this lift it up so as long as you have a little bit of the chin right here and you can't get this hand in just gonna lift this up, go under, chop, get, bring it in, finish. So the last thing, maybe, is when he is, he doesn't want this pressure. You have a lot of pressure here. Remember, your hands are turned in like this, so that's not. This part sticks out. Go in like that. Once he does that, we're gonna take this across. We're just going to lift up a little bit. And as we drop, we're pulling. So it's not just me pulling it across, lifting it up, going across. And now we have this side and this shoulder is gonna go in into his neck. What I wanna do is I want to take this hand and I'm going to pull it across as I take my shoulder and push it in. So once we're in here, I get this across, pull it in, push it in, and now bring his head and bring it in and just let it work. Just make sure the hand underneath, you're not just pulling, but you're also bringing it in like this, because if you just pull it across, it's gonna lose in place, but if you tighten it in and start going like that, it'll already work. One last thing is, if this is really loose and you don't have a good grip right here, as you push him across here, if he ducks under, just go with it. Let it slide a little bit, and what you end up is with the baseball grip over here. So we're going to bring him in a little bit using this. We're going to work our knee in. We're going to stick this one through. 
And as we do that, we're taking our elbow and bringing it up into here. Then working our way out. Part of the joke. I love that you will turn. <laughs> 